Arizona Senator John McCain also wrote an op-ed in the Washington Post calling on the president to stop attacking the press. But White House Press Secretary Sarah Sanders suggests the media is not fair when it comes to covering Mr. Trump. I think it's disgraceful the way that this president is treated. If he was anybody else, uh, the media would be going on and on trumpeting his successes. We have the best economy we've had in decades. Uh, people are back at work. Things are going well for America. And um, we have a president that is putting our country first. And I think that's something that should be celebrated, not mocked, not laughed at, and certainly uh, not attacked every second of every day. According to an analysis by the Media Research Center, the three major networks' coverage of President Trump during his first year in office was 90 percent negative. Steve Hilton is on the couch. Gosh, there's a lot to say about it. First of all, <laughs> let's get to Jeff Flake. I mean, he is just pandering to the uh, establishment, the elite. I don't know what his plans are after he leaves the Senate, but um, he is just so pompous. He's everything that people hate about politics and why people voted for Trump. Um, to, to say that criticizing media coverage is the same as despotism and silent is so absurd and over the top. Mm -hmm. The president is not trying to close down the press. He's just fighting back. And, and a good job, too, because for years, decades probably, you've had Republicans of all kinds right across the spectrum, not just populist Republicans like President Trump, but what today would describe as mainstream establishment Republicans completely dismissed and derided by the media, and they've never fought back. 